Hello everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Project Minecraft. I'm Casey, aka the Mega Miner, and today we will be looking at a campfire design made out of armor stands. Now, this is a design that I found on r slash Minecraft on Reddit. It was uh, designed by Jesper HB. He had an Imager gallery that showed how to do it, and I thought it'd be great if you could see a video form. So uh, I thought it'd uh, be a great idea, so let's just get started. So all of what you need is pretty much everything that's in my inventory. If there's something else that comes up, I'll be sure to let you know. But what you're going to start up by doing is dig a 3x5 hole. And that's two blocks deep. You're going to place a block of any kind right there. This is what the iron is acting as. You can use anything. Make sure it's not too valuable because you'll have lava around. So place the iron block there and a boat here. And you just want to go right here and nudge the boat right up against that iron block. So then take down that block, dig a hole under it, and then place your lava on the side where the wall is. Just let it slowly flow down, and then we're going to take more of these blocks. Go ahead and place one right here. And then you want to fence almost diagonally to the side of this block. Delete the two over there. It should end up like this. Then place one armor stand like this, and then we're going to repeat... Uh, the process of adding stands over and over so the first one I'm gonna do is just place one perpendicular drop it on down then we'll need two more that are diagonal to these just keep on doing that place one down take it away same thing things uh, drop really slowly so I feel like that's definitely a bug that will be patched up but who knows drop that on down and this is what it'll look like so then when we take these blocks away fence is gonna act as a midway point for us so we're gonna build a piston on the side just place it here add a lever you can use a uh, redstone torch whatever floats your boat take down these blocks here and then remove the fence and the iron block this will catch it on fire and it'll be in the midway point and it'll just uh, stay like this so then we're going to cover up the grass over here. All that should be left is a 1x2 area where the actual campfire is. And now you can't actually place the blocks to cover it up. So we need to build a little contraption out of pistons to push the grass blocks down. So I'm just going to do this little thing. Place some pistons here. This is the worst part. Again, just going to place levers on the side. You can use anything really. Whatever gets it done fast enough. I'm gonna place some grass blocks, activate it real quick, add some more, push it on down, then remove everything, and voila, you have your brand new campfire stand. So just a few notes about the campfire. I tried it, and I'm pretty sure if you set the time to night, it will not actually um, illuminate anything. So that's a bit of a downside. You're going to need to have torches around. As you can see, you can see it just fine, but it's not like it'll actually illuminate the blocks around it. So that is a problem. Uh, second of all, um, the campfire will get put out by rain. So if you are planning on having... Uh, it outdoors and uh, it'll be like a map or something where there will be rain you are going to need to have a canopy like this one makeshift right here or we'll put it out just like that so you can see that. and then third of all um, in some of my experimentation it uh sometimes will like glitch in and out when you're saving and quitting your world I think that is just another bug that goes along with the snapshot but again I'm not exactly sure so sometimes it'll disappear and you try to like delete it you can't see it just log back in and out or like save and quit the world a couple times and it uh, worked for me um, so anyway thank you so much for watching everybody uh, go ahead and uh, check out the original gallery and the original designer and uh, Sorry for not being uh, around on YouTube as much as I wanted to. I've been gone with vacation and a road trip and a whole lot of work, but we should hopefully get back underway. I've got a very special video planned for you guys soon. So stay tuned. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.